guys welcome back to the vlog channel or maybe i've started this vlog i don't know i of course i have like i'm literally the worst for this to be my job i am the worst i just brought the camera i was like i'm gonna be good we're gonna vlog tonight i forgot a memory card like the camera won't record without a memory card because there's nothing to remember what i'm recording question yes, have, have the new people already started moving into that house i don't this... i think so okay so the, all these yard sales are for the new people oh no those are for the old people you see they have a full trailer, yes. like pudding or thing. Yes. I can't tell if it's taking out or pudding. Y'all, okay, ridiculous. listen. We are like, I think there actually was a vlog. We were talking crap about that house People like a couple months mail. ago. So there was this house that has been near ours forever. It has gone up for sale every six months and then taken off the market every six months for probably the last 10 years. They were asking, I think, more than that house is worth. And then everybody in this area started building and buying all the land up, which makes me mad. And then all of a sudden the house sold. So there's it, a whole bunch of people. It's been on the market since. It's been on the market for, I think, like, 10 years. Well, it's, I'm so sorry y'all are shaking. It's been on there consistently this time since like October. But it's what happened it, it's was now selling. Now that they, they built three houses, literally there was like a strip of land that sat for a while. Three homes, that's what changed it all. Three homes got built in that um in that like strip of land and then everything around us exploded it was like those three homes made the huge difference but we are going to go to dinner tonight with my parents we're going to go to burt burgers and i'll put it on the screen i can't think what it's called it's in spartanburg um it's newer i think it's by our target so i'm going to go to target make a target run make a return um but we're gonna go with my parents so kind of all that's really happening today we are in prep mode for Jamaica everyone keeps asking if we're gonna do a review I mean I'm I'm down to do a review I did one on Barbados you you down to give them your opinion after yeah okay I mean I guess so the only thing that I'm stressed about so far and I don't usually get I'm at the top of my head it just makes happen. the only thing I don't get stressed when I travel I get stressed during takeoff and landing on a plane that's it like traveling doesn't stress me out, but all of the paperwork and making sure it's filed correctly and getting the COVID test back, that has me a lot stressed. Cause you have to like get your COVID test back and then file it with the country you're going to before you leave. And if you file it incorrectly, they won't let you in. And yeah, I don't think it's the country. I think it's this specific resort we're going to because yeah. they are still operating on like 60 percent yeah capacity. they're not at full capacity all right we're gonna go inside now actually we're gonna go my dad might probably still be on his call well like manager's call or whatever but we'll see you guys in a bit okay guys so we are home um you have to mute that baby okay so we ended up going to this really good place what was it called burgers and bakery so they bake their buns and their bakery items from scratch. The gluten that was one of the best gluten-free buns I've like ever, ever had in my whole life. Um, I got the trash can burger. It had the most surprising stuff. So it had a burger patty, coleslaw, ham, bacon. Not what I would think would go on a burger, but it was actually delicious. It wasn't what I thought. Like I wouldn't get it again, but it was delicious. It just I wanted something else. But we went to Target after with my parents, and um, we bought a bunch of stuff for Jamaica. So I figured I'd share with you guys. We even got Sam some stuff. Got him some swimming trunks. So it says Batman. Yep. Why is this cape green? I think that's just because it's, it's the yeah. Okay. So we got Sam these swim trunks. Cute, right? Um, they were twenty-five bucks. These were because he desperately, desperately needed some more. I got him some a couple years ago. Come on camera, I'm gonna need you to focus. Um, got him some a couple years ago. Why do I look so bad? Oh, um, and they were from Walmart and I, at the time, was like, I don't know, I feel like a medium will be too small, I don't know. So I got them large and they were way too big. Then we got the Speedo brand, just like a regular black and gray bathing suit, $30. And then I got a Speedo shirt, it's for men, actually. But it is a, where is it? Oh, I got the small. I don't think I realized it was. This is one of those UPF shirts that like has like 50 UPF or whatever. So it blocks like 90%, 98% of the sun's rays. And I've learned 
after 26 years on this earth that I get burned at the beach even when I'm I don't want to so I had to get something just in case I do get burned and then I also got socks because they had socks like one dollar fifty so I got sloths how cute little sloths so I needed some more sleeping socks Sam thinks I'm a serious like so dark in here Sam thinks I'm a serial killer because I sleep in socks. So as far as like travel stuff, I try to get as much travel stuff as possible that's like already like pre-packaged um, so that I don't have to worry about it, like transferring it to a different bottle. The only thing I can't usually get is my shampoo and conditioner. So um, this time, these were the sunscreens we got. So we used this one already. We really like it. It's just very simple. It's a sport sunscreen, SPF 50 from Target. Just a cream. We did get a spray. This is the Bear Republic free of chemical sunscreen activities. It says it's a non nano zinc oxide spray and this one's a 50. So we start with the cream, touch up with this. Also got a SPF 100 because ginger. Um, we got a Vino daily moisturizing oil mist. I got this because my skin gets super, super dry in the sun as I'm sure everyone's does. So I got this cause it's like a spray oil. And then also aloe. I, I, are, I always prep as if I'm going to get sunburned. And I've actually been a lot better because I know it's coming now. So I like, I'm a little bit more careful. But you know. Um, I also got two little travel sets. Now I'm thinking why did I get two? Because I only needed one for my shampoo and conditioner. And then lotion. We got these. Sam got these little skin scrubbers because he doesn't like to use my stuff to exfoliate his skin so i bought these um travel size makeup wipes because i don't want to take my regular pack with me i got a it's the versed day dissolve cleansing balm because i don't want to take my whole one with me those are for here little nose strips um toothpaste this is this this is a full size this is literally a full size toothpaste Got our little baby soap. This is the one we like. It is Dr. Bronner's 18 in one hip lavender pure Castile soap. Sam's deodorant. Germex on Germex. I also will have Clorox wipes with me for the plane. Sam's shampoo and conditioner with the menthol in it from Dove. He likes this one. And then I bought a baby hairspray and a baby dry shampoo. And then also this little travel container. So that's really it that we got from Target. We're just really finally starting to get in like prep mode for Jamaica. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and be straight up. We are not vlogging when we are there. I will be working. We will share a review of the resort afterwards, but I am not gonna vlog because we're going one with our friends. And I've told you guys, I'm like protective of my friends. I say this all the time. I chose to be on YouTube. They did not. Um, and they may be fine with being on YouTube, but I would never ask that of them. We're just going to hang out and chill. So. I do not ever vlog my friends, especially because people on the internet are evil. And again, I signed up for this, like they did not. So I would never expect them or put them in a position where they feel like they needed to be like, yeah, or like, no. So I just don't even ask. I'm just gonna go with a no. Um, so we won't be like vlogging while we're there, but we will do a review and everything when we get back. So I've got to work for the rest of the night. Um, all this stuff is gonna get put up, I'll share. That actually would probably be in Tuesday's vlog. Um, I have some more stuff that's coming in over the next couple days. Like Sam's suitcase that we got in. It gets the most amazing reviews. And it's like hard sided, 360 spinner. So I'll share that with you guys when we do get that in. But in the meantime, I'm going to work while this one over here plays with his Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Because he has not been able to find them anywhere. Hey guys, happy Sunday. <laughs> so what day it is. Um, so I did not close out the vlog. So I was going to take a second here and just do that. And hold on. And I have always said like the, the best tips ever 
are not found from influencers they're found from you guys or like you guys told an influencer a tip or a trick or whatever and they found it and relayed the message so i have actually learned a lot about the covid testing and restrictions and all that stuff from some of you guys on insta one of my um girlfriends from high school is messaging me right now she travels a lot and she was telling me where she got like where her and her husband got their um covid test just recently and it's there's just so much that's going into the strip that i I'm like I'm not stressed like I I think I'm I'm not like constantly stewing in this stressful place um, and I think that's what like stressed when I say I'm stressed means like I'm not stewing in constant stress I'm just like I know when I get to the airport I'm not gonna be cool calm and collected like I normally am I'm just gonna be like did I file my paperwork right do I have everything is this all right is this all right um so I will chill when we get to the hotel <laughs> And we are in our room. Oh my god, I pick up. But I wanted to tell you guys thank you so much for watching this vlog. Um, we were gonna ha we're gonna have more videos coming throughout the week, but we will not be vlogging. I think I've already talked about this um, when we're in Jamaica. So I'll share Sam's suitcase. It, it was supposed to come in today, but I think it's supposed to come in now tomorrow or Tuesday. So I'll share that in the next vlog. Um, but there will be vlogs coming. I just. I just have so much I have to do tonight, so I want to go ahead and close it out. Thank you guys so much for watching. We love you guys so much, and we will see you in our next vlog.